I'd like to call the uh, public session to order. Uh, I, there's nobody that signed up to speak. Would anybody in the audience like to uh, address the council? Seeing none, I will close public session and the regular meeting starts at 7.30. I'd like to call the meeting to order. Will you please rise for the Pledge of Allegiance? I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Clerk, please call the roll. His Honor the Mayor. Here. Councilor Reynolds. Here. Councilor McLaughlin. Here. Councilor Remmons. Here. Councilor Walker. Councillor Gosick. Here. Councillor Van Buren. Here. Councillor Cordino. Here. All present. Thank you. I have a couple uh, items under the mayor's report, a couple of proclamations. The first proclamation is uh, honoring uh, Salvation Army Christmas Kettle Fund Drive season, season uh, from November 17th to December 23rd, 2017. Uh, the proclamation reads, whereas the Salvation Army has been in existence for over 100 years, and whereas the mission of the Salvation Army is to meet human needs without discrimination, and whereas the Christmas Kettle Drive is a yearly funding effort to help local families and individuals in time of need by raising money to buy food baskets for families and toys for children, and whereas over 379 families were helped during the 2016 Christmas season, which included 641 children, and whereas last year's Salvation Army Christmas Kettle Drive exceeded its goal of $85,000, and the goal for this year, this year is to reach $76,000. And whereas all funds raised will be reinvested in the Oswego County community to provide food and clothing for those in need, operate the food pantry and soup kitchen, and distribute monthly food boxes, provide breakfast and lunch Monday through Friday, and for operating expenses. And whereas the Christmas kettle drive will kick off on November 17th, run through December 23rd, 2017. Now therefore I, William J. Barlow Jr., Mayor of the City of Oswego, do hereby proclaim November 17th, 2017 through December 23rd, 2017 as Salvation Army Christmas Kettle Fund Drive season and encourage all Oswego citizens to support the very dedicated people of the Salvation Army in this very worthy cause. Dated November 13th, 2017. And I have Captain Heather Odin and Captain uh, Wendy Sr. here to present the proclamation. Steve will take it. <laughs> Good. Don't be bashful. To you. Thank you guys for all you do. Appreciate it. Oh, nice. Wow. Hear that, counselors? Uh, there's 25 of them. I know, right? <laughs> 
<laughs> well, perfect. All right. Yeah. Sounds good. Uh, I have another proclamation, and we have a special guest tonight, and I'd like to call him up right now, uh, Mr. Joseph Castaldo, if you can come on up. I'll have you come up while I read it so you can hear me. Right? Uh, <laughs> no counseling. So, uh, if you want to turn around, I have a uh, proclamation, and uh, it's honoring uh, Mr. Casteldo for his 90th birthday, which is Thursday. Officially Thursday? 16. 16th. Uh, and Mr. Costeldo is a very uh, important member of the Oswego community. He was self-employed uh, for many years with uh, his wife and his families here uh, tonight. I appreciate you guys taking the time to come here. Built many uh, iconic Oswego buildings. Uh, a very hard worker, a very good man. I had the pleasure of uh, meeting Mr. Costeldo while I was campaigning and spent a few nights at his house trying to earn his vote, which was no easy task, but uh, I guess I really don't know if I ever got it. But anyway, um, I just wanted to take a moment because uh, you've done so much good work for the Oswego community and really left your mark on the Oswego community. Uh, I wanted to make sure that we appropriately acknowledge you tonight. So I prepared a proclamation with the help of uh, Councillor Cordino, and I'd like to uh, read that here uh, tonight. So the proclamation is honoring Joseph D. Casteldo on his uh, 90th birthday. Whereas it is a happy occasion when we can recognize and commend those individuals of distinguished purpose whose lives have been committed to serving the needs of their community in this noble port city. And whereas within every community there are inevitably some individuals who by virtue of their energy, vision, intelligence, and imagination deserve the greatest respect among their friends and colleagues. And whereas the family and faith of Joseph D. Casteldo and Alma May Mitchell Costeldo have always been the centerpiece of their lives, and whereas Cindy, Sandy, and Patty exemplify a proud example of values instilled by two loving parents who happily shared those virtues with their own children, and whereas Joseph D. Costeldo and Alma May Costeldo built a successful business brick by brick, employing Oswego residents, purchasing from local businesses, and paying local taxes, therefore positively impacting our local economy for many decades while improving our city's landscapes. And whereas projects such as Elcan Aluminum, Nine Mile Point, Sunrise Residential Health Care and Rehabilitation Center, the Riverfront Office Building, St. Joseph's Church and Parish Center, the West Side Oswego Fire Station, and a host of other glowing endeavors illustrate talent, fortitude, hard work, and commitment now, therefore, I, William J. Barlow, Jr., as mayor of the city of Oswego, and on behalf of a grateful community, do hereby thank Joseph D. Costeldo for stellar citizenship and extend sincere greetings on the occasion of Joseph D. Costeldo's 90th birthday. Happy birthday, Joe. You're welcome. Very good. We'll grab some photos. <laughs> Right for me. I never, ever had anything but the best interest in the city. It worked all. Very good. This is yours. Thank you. I want to thank the council. Yep. Thank you. And uh, lastly, under the mayor's report, I just wanted to say a special thank you and uh, a sad, at least for me, and I'm sure uh, the city council and Oswego city government, and I'm sure the Palladium Times as well, a uh, goodbye to uh, Ben Cal. Uh, he's been a reporter here for, uh, I'm not sure quite how long, but as long as I've been mayor, I'm, I know that. And he's always been very fair, honest, uh, accessible, and uh, I certainly appreciate the uh, positive coverage and the uh, coverage in general that he's uh, given to the city of Oswego and I'm sure I speak on behalf of uh, the city council that we were always 
uh, very comfortable talking to Ben. We knew his story would be fair and objective. And uh, I just appreciate uh, your hard work and commitment to uh, informing the residents of the city of Oswego. And good luck in your new job at the day. He's moving back or to uh, New London, Connecticut. So best of luck, Ben, and thank you for all you've done here at City Hall. <laughs> That's it under the mayor's report. Anything from the Common Council? Seeing none, will clerk please call resolution 423. Approved minutes, Common Council meeting held October 23rd, 2017. Councillor Emmons, Councillor Gozik, any comments? Clerk please call the roll. Councillor Reynolds? Yes. Councillor McLaughlin? Yes. Councillor Emmons? Yes. Councillor Walker? Yes. Councillor Gozik? Yes. Councillor Van Buren? Yes. Councillor Cordino? Resolution passes 7-0. Clerk, please call resolution 424. Appoint Commissioner of Deeds. Councillor Van Buren, Councillor Walker. Any comments? Clerk, please call the roll. Councillor Reynolds. Yes. Councillor McLaughlin. Yes. Councillor Emmons. Yes. Councillor Walker. Yes. Councillor Gosick. Yes. Councillor Van Buren. Yes. Councillor Cordino. Yes. Resolution passes 7-0. Clerk, please call resolution 425. Accept the donation of a park bench in honor of Scott Wilson Davis. Councillor Van Buren, Councillor McLaughlin. Any comments? Clerk, please call the roll. Councillor Reynolds. Yes. Councillor McLaughlin. Yes. Councillor Emmons. Yes. Councillor Walker. Yes. Councillor Gosick. Yes. Councillor Van Buren. Yes. Councillor Cordino. Yes. Resolution passes 7 0. Clerk, please call resolution 426. Approve road closures for the Oswego YMCA reindeer run to be held Saturday, December 2nd, 2017. Councillor Gosick, Councillor Cordino. Any comments? Call the roll. Councillor Reynolds. Yes. Councillor McLaughlin. Yes. Councillor Emmons. Yes. Councillor Walker. Yes. Councillor Gosick. Yes. Councillor Van Buren. Yes. Councillor Cordino. Yes. Resolution passes 7-0. Clerk, please call resolution 427. Authorize public hearing regarding Empire State Development Round 5 Restore New York Preserving Landmarks of Oswego West. Councillor Gosick. Councillor Emmons. Uh, this uh, public hearing is uh, required in order to apply for uh, the Restore New York grant. Uh, our application will consist of uh, two projects. Uh, the first project will be asking for $360,000 for uh, rehabilitation work to the Bridey Manor building. Uh, that's one of the oldest buildings in the city of Oswego, built in uh, 1828, I believe. And uh, I went down and toured it, met with the uh, business owner, Larry Lombardo, and talked about how uh, we could uh, possibly help that building and secure that building so it's around for many, many decades uh, to come. Also, a uh, $250,000 uh, application for the uh, train station, the old train station building on West Utica Street. That building's actually owned by Mr. Casteldo, who was just here. Uh, he's been working with us, and his grandson Joe has been working with us to put together some uh, viable plans in a development uh, project for that uh, building. Uh, so that is uh, an ask our application as well. Uh, any comments uh, from the council? Seeing none, will clerk please call the roll. Councillor Reynolds? Yes. Councillor McLaughlin? Yes. Councillor Emmons? Yes. Councillor Walker? Yes. Councillor Gosick? Yes. Councillor Van Buren? Yes. Councillor Cordino? Yes. Resolution passes 7-0. Clerk please call resolution 428. Mm -hmm. Authorize public hearing regarding New York State or New York State Lake Ontario Flood Relief Program. Councillor Reynolds, Councillor Gozik, any comments? Clerk, please call the roll. Councillor Reynolds. Yes. Councillor McLaughlin. Yes. Councillor Emmons. Yes. Councillor Walker. Yes. Councillor Gozik. Yes. Councillor Van Buren. Yes. Councillor Cordino. Yes. Resolution passes 7 0. Clerk, please call resolution 429. Authorize Mayor to sign change order number 7 with Marcellus Construction Company Incorporated for project modifications to the combined sewer separation second 25%. Councillor Cordino, Councillor Van Buren. Any comments? Or please call the roll. Councillor Reynolds. Yes. Councillor McLaughlin. Yes. Councillor Emmons. Yes. Councillor Walker. Yes. Councillor Gosick. Yes. Councillor Van Buren. Yes. Councillor Cordino. Yes. Resolution passes 7 0. Clerk, please call resolution 430. Authorize Mayor to sign change order number 8 with Marcellus Construction Incorporated for project modifications to the combined sewer separation, second 25%. Councillor Reynolds, Councillor McLaughlin. Any comments? Clerk, please call the roll. Councillor Reynolds. Yes. Councillor McLaughlin. Yes. Councillor Emmons. Yes. 
Councillor Walker. Yes. Councillor Gosick. Yes. Councillor Van Buren. Yes. Councillor Cordino. Yes. Resolution passes 7 0. Clerk, please call resolution 431. Authorize Mayor to sign all documents necessary to continue the professional auditing services of Encero Incorporated and Company. Councillor Cordino, Councillor Gosick. Any comments? Clerk, please call the roll. Councillor Reynolds. Yes. Councillor McLaughlin. Yes. Councillor Edmund. Yes. Councillor Walker. Yes. Councillor Gosick. Yes. Councillor Van Buren. Yes. Councillor Cordino. Yes. Resolution passes 7 0. Clerk, please call resolution 432. Authorize Mayor to enter into an agreement with Butler Disposal Systems Incorporated for the removal and disposal of trash and recyclable materials from city-owned facilities. Councillor Reynolds, Councillor Van Buren. Any comments? Clerk, please call the roll. Councillor Reynolds. Yes. Councillor McLaughlin. Yes. Councillor Edmund. Yes. Councillor Walker. Yes. Councillor Gosick. Yes. Councillor Van Buren. Yes. Councillor Cordino. Yes. Resolution passes 7 0. Clerk, please call resolution 433. Authorize Mayor to sign all service agreements with New Vision Communication for the maintenance of copper phone lines. Councillor Van Buren, Councillor McLaughlin. Any comments? Clerk, please call the roll. Councillor Reynolds. Yes. Councillor McLaughlin. Yes. Councillor Edmund. Yes. Councillor Walker. Yes. Councillor Gosick. Yes. Councillor Van Buren. Yes. Councillor Cordino. Yes. Resolution passes 7 0. Clerk, please call resolution 434. Authorize Mayor to enter into an agreement with the Oswego City School District for a school resource officer. Councillor Walker, Councillor McLaughlin, any comments? Clerk, please call the roll. Councillor Reynolds. Yes. Councillor McLaughlin. Yes. Councillor Emmons. Yes. Councillor Walker. Yes. Councillor Gosick. Yes. Councillor Van Buren. Yes. Councillor Cordino. Yes. Resolution passes 7 0. Clerk, please call resolution 435. Approved bid submitted by WCA Roofing and Sheet Metal Company Incorporated for the replacement of the roof at the animal shelter. Councillor Reynolds, Councillor Van Buren, any comments? Clerk, please call the roll. Councillor Reynolds. Yes. Councillor McLaughlin. Yes. Councillor Emmons. Yes. Councillor Walker. Yes. Councillor Gosick. Yes. Councillor Van Buren. Yes. Councillor Cordino. Yes. Resolution passes 7 0. Clerk, please. Call resolution 436. Authorize City Chamberlain to execute the necessary accounting procedures to prepare all funds for the year 2017 closure. Councillor Van Buren, Councillor Walker, any comments? Clerk, please call the roll. Councillor Reynolds. Yes. Councillor McLaughlin. Yes. Councillor Emmons. Yes. Councillor Walker. Yes. Councillor Gosick. Yes. Councillor Van Buren. Yes. Councillor Cordino. Yes. Resolution passes 7 0. Clerk, please call resolution 437. Authorize transfer of certain city-owned properties to the Oswego County Land Bank. Councillor Walker, Councillor Van Buren. Uh, the three properties uh, will be 28 Ontario Street in the First Ward, 118 East First Street in the Fourth Ward, and 249 West 7th Street in the Fifth Ward. We're uh, deeding these properties over to the Land Bank specifically for the purpose of being rehabilitated, and at that point the Land Bank will hopefully find buyers uh, to occupy these homes any comments from the council? Uh, seeing none, please call the roll. Councillor Reynolds. Yes. Councillor McLaughlin. Yes. Councillor Emmons. Yes. Councillor Walker. Yes. Councillor Gosick. Yes. Councillor Van Buren. Yes. Councillor Cordino. Resolution passes 7 0. Clerk, please call resolution 438. Approve budget amendment to the water fund. Councillor Cordino, Councillor Van Buren. Any comments? Clerk, please call the roll. Councillor Reynolds. Yes. Councillor McLaughlin. Yes. Councillor Emmons. Yes. Councillor Walker. Yes. Councillor Gosick. Yes. Councillor Van Buren. Yes. Councillor Cordino. Yes. Resolution passes 7 0. Clerk, please call resolution 439. Approved transfer of funds from within the Department of Engineering. Councillor McLaughlin, Councillor Walker. Any comments? Clerk, please call the roll. Councillor Reynolds. Yes. Councillor McLaughlin. Yes. Councillor Emmons. Yes. Councillor Walker. Yes. Councillor Gosick. Yes. Councillor Van Buren. Yes. Councillor Cordino. Yes. Resolution passes 7 0. Clerk, please call resolution 440. Approved transfer of funds from within the Fire Department. Councillor Cordino, Councillor Gosick. Call the roll. Councillor Reynolds. Yes. Councillor McLaughlin. Yes. Councillor Emmons. Yes. Councillor Walker. Yes. Councillor Gosick. 
Yes. Councilor Van Buren. Yeah. Councilor Cordino. Yeah. Resolution passes 7-0. Please call resolution 441. Authorize a budget transfer from the ambulance collection account to the garage equipment account and the garage materials and supplies account. Councilor Van Buren, Councilor McLaughlin. Any comments? Or please call the roll. Councilor Reynolds. Yes. Councilor McLaughlin. Yes. Councilor Emmons. Yes. Councilor Walker. Yes. Councilor Gosick. Yes. Councilor Van Buren. Yes. Councilor Cordino. Yes. Resolution passes 7 0. Or please call resolution 442. Approve attendance at the FBI National Academy to be held January 8, 2018 through March 16, 2018 in Quantico, Virginia. Request of Tory L. D. Care Police Chief. Councillor McLaughlin, Councillor Gosick, any comments? Or please call the roll. Councillor Reynolds. Yes. Councillor McLaughlin. Yes. Councillor Emmons. Yes. Councillor Walker. Yes. Councillor Gosick. Yes. Councillor Van Buren. Yes. Councillor Cordino. Yes. Resolution passes 7 0. Clerk, please call resolution 443. Waive rules of the Common Council to present resolutions numbers 444 and 445 from the floor without committee consideration. Councillor Emmons, Councillor Van Buren. Any comments? Clerk, please call the roll. Councillor Reynolds. Yes. Councillor McLaughlin. No. Councillor Emmons. Yes. Councillor Walker. Yes. Councillor Gosick. Yes. Councillor Van Buren. Yes. Councillor Cordino. Resolution passes 6-1. Clerk, please call resolution 444. Accept bid submitted by 180 Flood Drive Properties for the sale of junk and abandoned vehicles. Councilor Walker, Councilor Van Buren. Uh, the submitted bid is in the amount of $6,624.38 for 35 junk and abandoned vehicles currently stored at Councilor Reynolds. Yes. Councilor McLaughlin. Yes. Councilor Emmons. Yes. Councilor Walker. Yes. Councilor Gosick. Yes. Councilor Van Buren. Yes. Councilor Cordino. Yes. Resolution passes 7-0. Clerk, please call resolution 445. Approve amendments to the City of Oswego purchasing policy. Councilor Emmons, Councilor Walker. Uh, this uh, simply uh, raises the discretionary spending limit in each department from to 3,000. These hasn't been, this uh, limit hasn't been raised in uh, several years and is uh, below uh, state minimums, is my understanding. Any comments? Please call the roll. Councilor Reynolds. Yes. Councilor McLaughlin. Oh. Councilor Emmons. Yes. <coughs> Councilor Walker. Yes. Councilor Gosick. Yes. Councilor Van Buren. Yes. Councilor Cordino. Yes. Resolution passes 6-1. Any other uh, business to come I'll take a motion to adjourn. Councillor uh, Walker, Councillor Van Buren. Clerk, please call the roll. Councillor Reynolds. Yes. Councillor McLaughlin. Yes. Councillor Emmons. Yes. Councillor Walker. Yes. Councillor Gosick. Yes. Councillor Van Buren. Yes. Councillor Cordino. Yes. Resolution passes 7 0. Meeting is adjourned. Yeah, like, like me.